I'm Clinton Griffiths with today's Ag Day Minute. The FDA is continuing to test the nation's milk supply after traces of dead avian flu virus were found. The agency releasing initial results of its study saying one in five milk samples it looked at tested positive for signs of the virus. But scientists continue to say the risk to the general public is still low and milk on the shelves is safe to drink, attributing that to the pasteurization process which kills the virus and other pathogens. Now the dairy industry putting in new mandatory testing requirements before lactating dairy cows can be moved from state to state. Those requirements coming into effect Monday. USDA is updating its outlook when it comes to food prices now expecting Prices for all food to increase 2.2% with grocery store prices expected to go up by 1.2%. It represents a slight decrease from last month's outlook. It notes that most food categories are predicted to see price changes below their 20 year historical average in 2024. And the city of Minneapolis, Minnesota has approved a $15 minimum price for cigarette packs. It represents the highest in the nation. Backers of the plan and city officials hope it will encourage smokers to quit and and save money that would otherwise be spent treating smoking-related illnesses. For more Ag News, watch Ag Day weekdays on this station or anytime at agweb.com.